Welcome everyone to Weekend Escapades. We have found an abandoned location in the middle of the Mojave Preserve. And this is just outside of Nipton, California, around Ivanpah in between the two and buried in the middle of the desert. Now this place is completely fenced all the way around with six foot chain link. There's an old shoe tree on this property as well. People have come out here in the desert. Left all the shoes. I didn't bring any extras, so I'm not leaving mine. This old abandoned house here. And there was a chain across this fence. But it did not say no trespassing. Now I'd be lying if I didn't think that this place here was a little scary and every time I walked around this building I expected somebody to pop out with a shotgun. It was abandoned for sure. Again, it was chained off but it was not locked. So we went on inside but that's just a little unnerving to think that maybe somebody's still camping out here but how would they survive in the middle of the desert in all this tremendous heat? We found this because we were driving down the main road and you could see a mile off in the distance that something was sticking up in the middle of the desert, a couple of trees and maybe a dwelling, but it happened to be a water tower. And this is what it is, looking like a compound. If anybody knows what this area was, please comment below, but this is very hidden. I wonder what this was. It's the only piece of like uh, newer construction cement that was out here. An interesting construction at that. And then a foundation around it. This one's fallen in. This is an old shed as well. A little refrigerator in it. You don't want to go digging around too much in some of these old places because you never know what the heck you're going to find. But you got to just stick your nose in there and look around a little bit. I don't want to know what's in that refrigerator. What do we have out here? An old abandoned vehicle. What is that? Is that possibly an old Lincoln? Not much left of it. Sitting out here hidden behind this old building on a property that looks suspiciously like we shouldn't be on it. But when you find something abandoned like this in the middle of nowhere, you just want to check it out. Let me see if I can see inside this one as well. This one's all wired off. Looks like some kind of a compound, to be honest with you. Like somebody lived out here in the middle of the desert, wanted to be left alone. An old toilet in the back. I'm not walking on those floors. This is one of the most interesting locations that we have found. And let me tell you, it was not easy getting here. We had it down one road and it was washed out completely as there was monsoons just a few days before. And then when we finally found an alternate route, it was very rough getting here, but when we pulled up to these gates, you just knew this was something to see. You look around the property with the giant water tower and the dwellings that are on this property and you wonder who lived here and what were they doing? And this had a, uh, a pump system. You could see out here with all the valves, uh, just sitting in the desert. Obviously there was a spring or a well or something where they piped the water in to that water tower to survive on this property. If anybody knows any story about this property, please comment below as I am very interested to find out what happened here and how things were in the past. So on down the road we go, we're gonna find out what's left of Ivanpah proper. Now there's not much here, as there's only a couple people living in the area, but there are some old foundations that were left of the adobe buildings in the area and also some buildings that were off in the distance. Now, where these buildings are located, there appears to be a few trailers and fifth wheels uh, where people are living, so we couldn't get very close. Uh, as it said, no trespassing all over these properties. But uh, it looks like somebody has maybe bought the property and moved in. But here's the old picture of the mill that lived up on the hill. And I'm walking here uh, next to the railroad tracks. You can see this is a much older set of tracks because this is the the area where they 
come off the two tracks here, obviously. And then you can see up here, there's a switch and it comes down here. So going this direction, you can see this was a, a train station or a loading station. As there was a lot of mining here. And this is where they offloaded or unloaded things off the train as it came in. And this is a really big station and there's nothing left but a foundation. So it almost looks like, I can't tell if there was a building built on this. Hopefully I can find a picture of this area. It's like that's an old loading ramp right there, an old piece of metal and some tin up there. So there's still some remnants, but not much uh, of this rail station. Ivanpah is an old silver mining town that was very short-lived. Now this mining town is located in San Bernardino County in California, just off the California-Nevada border. Now this was founded in 1869 and existed until at least the mid-1800s, and there is certainly not much left to see but a few foundations. Now I've seen pictures of this area from before and there's some old water cisterns and uh, just some, some pieces of cement and foundation things in this area around this train station, but really not much left at all. The strangest thing was, is while walking around here, we actually found bamboo growing. And that was really strange in the desert to find a couple of bamboo uh, bushes that were whatever you would call it uh, in the area. Uh, just a couple of railroad ties and some things sticking up out of the ground but I could not find a picture of the old rail station in Ivanpah. We hope you enjoyed this amazing find in the middle of the Mojave Preserve in California, and until our next adventure, goodbye from Weekend Escapades, and we'll see you in the next one.